Shani, first of all, you must be so happy to just be back on court this week. Yeah, definitely. It's really hard sitting on the sidelines, so to be able to get back out on court and try and do my thing, it was heaps of fun and, yeah, it's just so good to be part of this team. Coming up against Romelda Aiken, it's always a tough task, but the defence end seem to get a few of their own back as well. Yeah, absolutely, because when you play someone like Romelda, it's all about putting the pressure up out front and Sonia, Abby and Kimmy, like, they all just did such a great job of that and because of that, they were all getting turnovers, which is awesome. How do you feel after your first game back? How's the hand going? Oh, Oh, just unreal. I think um, it's just getting get back into the groove now. Like I've just got to keep my feet moving. I felt a bit static at times, but that will continue to grow as the season goes now, which is exciting. Kim Green was MVP. What are a few words you can say about your captain's performance? Oh, she was unreal today. Just sitting back. I was like, she's getting like intercepts that goalkeepers are meant to get. It was just so good to watch. And her work ethic is out of control. Like I get puffed in goalkeeper. I have no idea how she does it in centre, and I have so much respect for her. Well, moving Moving on to next week, there's another tough task in probably Irene Van Dyke back at Shooter. Is it pretty much the same approach as you had for tonight? A little bit different. Um, Van Dyke's tall but not as tall as Romelda and her and Donna Wilkins are quite smart as well and so it's a bit more of a moving game compared to that one static and the moving goal attack. So we do have to be, um, I guess, not smarter than today, you've got to be smart in every game but just a little bit more proactive and working with Sonia. Well, thanks Shani, good luck for next week. Thank you all.